Okay then. I should be live by now. Unless I've got some god awful technical difficulty that didn't come up during my test stream yesterday. And the music seems to be a little too loud. Hmm. Okay, yes, we are live now. So, welcome everybody to my t live stream. Yes, welcome to my live stream. This is my celebration type thingy for my two year anniversary uploading videos to YouTube. Which said anniversary was actually on this past Thursday, so I'm a few days late, but school, you know. I can't exactly do these live streams while I'm in class, now can I? And... First of all, I just want to mention, I have absolutely no idea how long the stream's actually going to be. So that's going to be random. I can promise it'll be at least a couple hours, though. And oh bloody hell, my laptop that I was using to look at the chat has just decided to restart, so I can't actually see what anybody's saying right now or who's actually in the chat. So, that's going to take a bit. Let me see if I can fix this. Okay, well, for the time being, I'll just have to ignore that and carry on. I checked on this earlier, so I know that I am, in fact, capable of streaming, and this isn't... I'm not getting some stupid error that's going on right now. So there's that, at least. Okay, so the chat room is open on my tablet. Maybe I can use that. Anyhow, I'm sorry I'm a little bit late. I n know that my video I put up, if there's anyone here who's actually playing here because of this live stream and hasn't just found it randomly. Anyhow, I know the video I put up on my YouTube channel said I'd be starting at 3.30 and it's I've ever so slightly past that, but I was having trouble remembering that stuff. So, yeah, the first game I'm going to be playing is XCOM Enemy Within. And this is the vanilla version. This is straight up Enemy Within. I'm not playing with the Long War mod or anything. Much as I do love that mod. I'm not playing with it right now. And first off... I'm going to delete all of my save games because I don't even remember when those are from, so let's not take the risk. So I'm going to be starting a new game. And I don't do this much just because I'm terrible at XCOM, I really am. But I'm going to be playing this on classic difficulty. And advanced option, we'll leave the DLC on. I'm not going to play either tutorial because I've played this game a number of times, despite sucking at it. 
I will reduce beginner VO. Sorry, Dr. Volan, you don't get to nag me about explosives. And we don't need Brad for telling us about the fact that each soldier type does X. Or maybe Y. We don't need to hear about that. So I'm going to go through these a little bit. Let's see. Damage roulette? No. <clears throat> it That just means the damage can be either a lot lower or a lot higher. And I don't like that. <clears throat> Randomized funding, though. I'll think about that. <clears throat> Random starting stats? Yes. I don't want all the soldiers being the same. I like a little randomness in my life. Let me see here. Do, 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 do. A flanking shot will guarantee a critical. That could make my life a little interesting, so I'll take it. Actually, no, I won't. I'll take aiming angles instead. Aim bonus the closer you are. So that's for both us and the aliens. It's going to make my life... Slightly interesting, but I'm going to go with it. So, now we will start the game. And no, I don't want the freaking tutorial. Those who play with the devil's toys will be brought by degrees to wield his sword. Buckminster Fuller. Honestly, I don't like that quote. I prefer the one in the original XCOM, where it goes, uh, two possibilities exist, either we are alone in the universe or we are not. Both are equally terrifying. I think that fit the XCOM games a lot better than that quote right there, which I honestly think is kind of crap. And the obligatory kidnap victim at the beginning of XCOM getting himself abducted because he approached the alien object and tried to touch it. Let this be a lesson for you kiddies. Do not, tr do not try and touch strange objects falling from the sky that land in your backyard. Because you'll get abducted by aliens. Oh, oh look, it's Agent 47. Extraterrestrial incursion. This Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative. To oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. With my track record, I'm gonna need it. As I have an unfortunate habit of getting my soldiers killed. <clears throat> and base location. I could go with any of these, but I'm just going to pick Africa for the more funding, because that's the most handy as far as I'm concerned. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Alrighty, let's launch the mission.
Strike one, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. All right, suppose we can do that. So you take cover on a car, and you as well. Which, to anyone who knows XCOM, that is a colossally dumb move to make. Taking cover on a car in XCOM is very little diff. There's very little difference between that and assisted suicide. I kid you not. And I think I'm taking cover on a gas tank with one of my people, which is unfortunate. Aliens already. Two damage from my overwatch. Not bad. We know they're in that direction, though. So, folks, get yourself into some better cover. And Overwatch. And we'll try to bait them into coming for us. You both missed. Well done. Two damage to one of my soldiers. Enemy troops. And three more aliens. I almost called them aliens there. That would have been embarrassing. That's actually to do with a forum that I used to participate in. And this XCOM AAR, I'll explain what that is another time. Anyhow, I need to check my graphics settings. I just realized that. Apparently, I've got every not got everything on high. Or I didn't before. That is not good. I am going to try to kill some aliens. One dead alien. I think you'll find I'm quite happy about that. You can move there, I think. <laughs> Apparently... You have less of a shot now than you did before. And you shoot and miss, apparently. Missed. I think this is worth it. I am going to frag their asses. <laughs> He's down to one hit point. You move up. 15% chance to hit. I'm not gonna risk it. <laughs> we have additional aliens moving in. But I'm not too bothered about these sectoids. He took a lot of... He took 